it's like the videos have no order. So no, sorry. Hey everybody, we're gonna be doing a reaction to Grab Your Friends by Joe Cat. These are all people that have not like subscribed to with this account. Okay, so I'm just gonna subscribe with this one. And let's get ready. It's sponsored by Wizards of the Coast, apparently, so let's see. This video is sponsored Shaky. by Wizards of the Coast. But, okay. So what do you say? Interested? I don't know. I'll I'll think about it and I'll get back to you. Oh, oh, okay. Well, no worries. We can talk about it later. Thank you for the follow, by the way. So you want to game you with your, your friends, friends, but they are all new and have trouble. First off, can we just like agree that like Joe Cat's design is fucking adorable? But at the same time, why does he have such a lovely voice? Okay, stop simping, Dell. Stop simping. Playing pretend it all seems so hard to be in the right cards just to play. Do I know you? But luckily, hope is not, not lost. <laughs> you fucking. You're, you're just fucking kidnapping people with the power of musicals. Despite how it seems, there is it's very, very little, little cost oh. in. What the hell you mean, very little cost? D&D is expensive as fuck. Despite how it seems, there is ve entry free, very little cost, and open, cheap and open. <sighs> Tell that to you know uh, how they actually did shit. In fact, it's because like when you really want to buy them books, it's it it ain't fucking cheap. Sure, you can do it on your own, but it's hard as hell doing it on your own. At that point, you might as well just make your own RPG. Well, TT RPG. Quite painless in some ways, even brainless, and so, so I will teach you today. I don't. Why is it that his av like his fucking logo thing is so creepy when it's smiling? No. First, you get your friends together, and yes, you. I was actually expecting this to get really dark really fast. Hold up, let me check. Okay, never mind. He's not here. I don't have to pick him off the bus yet. You have them pique their interest, and then you grab them, show them live plays, or front short clips, or even the D and D movie. Is that actually a clip from the movie? Huh. That looks like good graphical effects. Let me check that out, really. Okay, that actually looks good. Wait. Oh, the teeth fucking come out of- Okay, that's actually attention to detail that I didn't expect from them. I was expecting the D&D movie to look like dog shit. I never really went out to do it. I just was like, eh, fuck it. It's gonna look like dog shit. That's time to start playing weekly. Make some characters that uniquely fit their fantasy or dumb memes or something completely left field but groovy. Tell them it's their chance to star in their own series where they can do anything. Save the I mean, try to do anything. The world or be the villain. <laughs> oh, there's nothing more funny than being a villain. Use an imagination, you can even smooch a king. This all sounds fun and everything, but I have a few concerns. La Bro, you can't idolize and worship Matt Mercer on your wall. We saw that shit. Also, the fucking goblin in the background is cute as hell. Like? I can't voice act or sing good songs. Embrace Bro, you don't have to voice act for shit. I'm a DM who's dog shit. It's the bad. It's fun as heck. I'm scared I might get rules all wrong. Just make some up, or you can check. But who will be the dungeon master? Who knows the most, or the bravest friend? But what if it all ends in disaster? Bro, when it all ends in disaster, it's fucking hilarious. Just laugh. It's fucking fun. Yee! Learn from mistakes and try again! Grab pen and paper and starting rule set And that's all you will need to start that game of D&D with your friends Can I have cars and laser guns? Sure! Or like fantasy, then do sci-fi Any setting can take its place by making homebrew or funhouse rules Through custom tailor your grand adventure D&D is so much more than how you start or how it ends Print some sheets and grab some oh, dice nice. and go Grab your friends. You know what? I actually.
actually do want to give it a try. Yeah! <laughs> Fucking yeah! I shouldn't have laughed at that part because I was like, I'm holding in laughter because I'm smiling ear to ear because it's like, hey, this is nice. This is just a good song. And it's also just teaching people to go and fucking play. God damn it. I was trying to be depressed, boy. Made me fucking nasty cheer up all of a sudden. I'm expecting, I'm expecting something to be at the end. Support Joe Cat. Okay. Anyways, I wish you all a merry day. I wish you all a merry day. Now get your ass out of here and see you all goodbye. <laughs>